here with Chef Jose Andres. Okay, Jose, we're talking about leftovers, uh, what to do after Thanksgiving. Um, uh, what's the most important thing to think about when you're doing leftovers? Friday morning. Friday morning, yes. Big headache. Yes. Because you've been drinking. Sure. You used to forget the turkey dry that you got the night before. <laughs> and what do you need? What do you need? Uh, a little hair of the dog. <laughs> In English, a cocktail. A cocktail, exactly. All so right. What do we do here? So we have uh, liquid nitrogen. Okay, I think it's I'm a, supposed to put these uh, on. It's an ingredient that you can buy anywhere. And, I mean, obviously. Obviously, you, everybody should have liquid nitrogen in their lives. <laughs> Why? Well, you, because... Everybody has leftover liquid nitrogen after Thanksgiving. Right. And then, yes. what are you wearing? What? Well, what is this? Uh, just uh... this is Thanksgiving, no Halloween, man. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> uh, I think I think our legal team says I have to wear these. Your, your legal team? Yes, exactly. Is ice about to come? Up? Okay. Mm -hmm. So. <laughs> oh. Wow. So soft. There you go. Wow. Okay. So what? Uh, why do we need the liquid nitrogen? What are we going to make? Because we're going to make an obviously frozen cranberry. Gin vermouth cocktail. Okay. I love doing this every year. You open it up, poke a hole in the bottom. <laughs> don't, don't, don't come to Thanksgiving at my house. There you go. Well, okay, so obviously, we it's Friday. Sure, sure. I'm so lucky. Thank you for not inviting me. So you put some of the cranberry okay. in Goes this in here. thing. And what's in there already? Um, whatever. My guys always go ahead. Okay. And, and then we put some uh, vermouth. Okay, beautiful. And then you're going to put some gin. How okay. do you pronounce it? Gin? Gin. Gin. That's it. Don't, don't put too much. Okay, good. Yeah. And then you're going to start here. Yeah. You're going to start putting... The liquid nitrogen, obviously. How much? Because all of it? I don't know. What's the, what, <laughs> what is you that in the recipe? I mean, you can't see anything. You open a can with your mouth and you're asking me for the recipe? <laughs> I think you're putting too much already. There That's you go. it. And then. <laughs> I think you put too much. Oh my God, you put too much. This is gonna explode. People, leave the building. <laughs> Leave the building! Okay. Oh, I forgot the champagne. Yes. Yes. Okay. This is going to break, really okay. going to break. All okay. right. And then put a little bit on this glass. This is a terrible segment. Okay. <laughs> and then you have the cranberry frozen. Oh, and beautiful. you top it with more of this amazing cava. Mm. And what you have here, the perfect cocktail to forget that your turkey was so dry. Mm. Mm. Perfect. Oh my God. Perfect, okay. And then. Okay, now we're gonna make, uh, what are we making with the turkey? Very quickly. So this is, because you cook more turkey than turkey you needed, you have an extra turkey that nobody ate because the first one was so dry. Yes. Why you will have the second one? What do you do? You s you break the turkey apart. Okay. You, uh, Shall I, uh, what's your favorite part? Uh, uh, I like uh, I like the I like the the, the thigh. Nope. Oh. <laughs> they, I'm the expert here. You, I like uh, the oysters. Do you know about it? <laughs> Where are you from, man? I'm from South Carolina. I knew it. Right here? Yeah, that's the oyster. Okay. Yeah, what well, you don't blow into it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> and oh, then, oh, yeah. yeah. Hey, give me that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, give me that. Okay, oh. uh, oyster is over here. And then you, you have all the pieces here, yeah. and you make a bechamel. Uh -huh. What a bechamel is? What's a bechamel? Uh, uh, butter, milk, yeah. flour yeah. to make a bechamel, a yeah. white sauce. You can't go wrong. And then you add all the leftovers. You can put some of the white meat, some of the dark meat, some of the stuffing, mm -hmm. maybe some of the green beans that nobody ate, maybe mm -hmm. some of the mashed potato, and you mix it. Okay. And then you make these balls. Okay. And you put them Ooh. in the flour like this. That's nice. And then, yeah, from the flour. Like gnocchi or something. No, that's Italian. We're cooking <laughs> a Spanish here, okay? 
okay, okay. For a day, this is a Spanish dish. Okay. And then you put it in the egg wash. Okay, in the egg wash. Okay. And then you... Croquetas. Boom. Okay. <laughs> And then, man, but you I know. Feel, I feel superfluous. And look right at now. this. You put okay. them in here and yes. you dip them in the fryer. Mm -hmm. And now they are frying and the croquetas are saying, wow, this is like a party. Wow. I'm so happy. Mm -hmm. This is like a hot bath, like yes. a hot tub. I'm so hot. And what do you have here? Oh. Mm. The best leftover turkey croqueta in the history of mankind. Mm. <laughs> oh my God. Are they good or what? Oh, good Lord. Oh my God. Nice catch. Ah! Oh my God. No, no, no. I forgive me, forgive me. Oh my God. Rob? To learn more about World Central Kitchen, go to WCK.org. Jose Andres, everybody!